Dent Wolverine Marvels with $96 million opening day, the sixth highest of all time. Disney and Marvel Studios' Deadpool and Wolverine clawed up a massive $96 million from 4,210 locations across Friday and preview screenings. That's far and away the biggest domestic opening day of the year, ahead of the $62 million that Inside Out 2 nabbed in June. Not only that, it's also the largest ever for an R-rated feature and the sixth highest of all time, not adjusted for inflation. That's an epic win for the Merc with the mouth and a big bounce back for Marvel Studios, which is coming off of its worst domestic performance ever with the Marvels last fall. The records will continue to fall this weekend as the Ryan Reynolds Hugh Jackman buddy comedy heads toward one of the biggest domestic debuts of all time. It's been a long road to theaters for Deadpool and Wolverine. Reynolds' previous outing as the superhero bowed in the summer of 2018 before 20th Century Fox was acquired by the Walt Disney Company. Much of the hype around this latest entry involves how comic book characters that were under the Fox umbrella, such as the X-Men, will be incorporated into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Then there was a release date bump amid last year's OGA and SAG AFTRA strikes. In recent weeks, Reynolds and Jackman have gone all out on a marketing blitz capped with an appearance at San Diego Comic-Con on Thursday alongside director Sean Levy and co-star Emma Corrin. Corrin.